everybody welcome back well today your girl is cooking today yes how's all my cousins doing good okay so today i am cooking some steak and some potatoes on the stove mm -hmm. you heard me right and i got some garlic bread going in the oven i got some tossed salad now you guys won't see me make the tossed salad because everybody know how to make tossed salad right Mm -hmm. Now, this is the steak and potatoes I'm concerned about, okay? So, if you're ready to see how I do this, stay tuned. So, we're going to start with the process of putting our garlic toast in the oven. Okay? Now, I got two pans rolling because one pan is for my potatoes. I need my potatoes to get brown, okay? So I'm gonna put them over here. Uh huh. So just some potatoes, roughly, is in there. Okay, and then I have this pan for my chuck steaks. Okay, you guys, for my chuck steaks. I think I'm going to have to wind up frying one at a time, but I want you guys to get the idea, because you just brown them, okay? I'm just browning them. Mm. Oh, well, well, I might as well put it on there. Let's put it this way. That way, that's good. Yeah. There we go. So I'm gonna turn my back to you guys, keep an eye on the food. So yeah, I'm making steak and potatoes, pan style, well on top of the stove, and started putting it in the broiler. So I just season it up with a little steak, seasoning. <clears throat> These have a little black pepper, plus Larry's seasoning sauce. And steak seasoning for the potatoes. So, you guys, I'll be back. Okay, so you guys, I am processing of uh, stirring up the potatoes, trying to get them to all cook somewhat, and I'm about to flip this meat. Yeah. Because like I said, once I bring the two together and let them join and do their thing, you know, get the taste on, then you will see the outcome. I haven't made this in such a long time. Well, you know, the steak I eat often. But I haven't made this in such a long time. This is one of my mother's favorite go-to meals. And... I just enjoy cooking it. Okay, you guys. As you can see, I cut up the steaks, turned them into six pieces. You know, basically, you know, I'm serving six people to enjoy. Okay. <laughs> So now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take these potatoes and I'm going to smurge them over with the steak, right? As you see, it was very little oil used. I used Western oil from cooking 
to cook the potatoes down. Okay. Now we're gonna get it to cooking along in here. Okay. So yeah. Like I said, quick and easy, simple meal. You guys. Very quick, easy something. You know, let me put this in the dishwater. Hope you guys can see. Potatoes are cooking very well, as you see. So some of my pork tender, some is still working. And that's what we gotta do. We gotta get it to working, okay? Let's get it to working. So yeah, you guys, leave a comment, tell me what you're cooking. Because on this glorious Sunday, this is what Miss T had a taste for. Yeah, like I say, you guys, it's quick and simple. It's just quick and simple. Okay? And I also mixed up some cornstarch. You can use any brand that you like. Cornstarch. And that's going to help with me a thickened gravy. Yes, it's going to help. Because as you see, there's some sauce down in here already. Because it rendered off the meats. Uh-huh. And, yeah, let me put that potato on over there. Because now we're just going to, you know, that's this. Yeah, I use one fourth of cornstarch and I'm gonna pour it over in here. And it's gonna help render my potatoes. Okay, you guys? So, I'll be back to show you the finishing touches. So, yeah, you guys, here go the finishing touches. We're at our peak. And I just want to bring you up a close-up, okay, you guys? There we go. So, yes, that's where we're at. You guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I had to break it down. <laughs> But yeah, that's what you're going for. Okay, that's your steak, that's your potatoes. And yeah, here go your garlic bread. Yes. Because I want one side brown and the other side not so brown. Oh, yeah, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If it's your first time tuning in, welcome, welcome. I hope you enjoy it enough to hit that subscribe and join the family. I would love to meet you. And yes, don't forget to thumbs this video up. Share this video with any and everyone. And yes, come back to the next video. I love you guys for all your love and your support you have given me this far, and I really appreciate it. And yeah, if you leave a comment, I am coming to your home. So until then, you guys, good night.